Hello guys, good morning. This is Elaine and welcome to another episode of our podcast. This is a podcast. Uh, I made a covenant to the Lord for myself and of course to you guys. Um, if you're listening this, I made a covenant to God, to me and to you to be able to do this podcast and be able to reflect the word of God and be sharing with you my thoughts and how I deal with you know life's up, ups and downs. Now, um, today is th- the 13th of February and it's currently 9 in the morning. I woke up a bit late today around <laughs> 8 a.m. and then of course I had my breakfast. Um, I drink water before coffee and then a toast and um, a piece of egg and that's it I'm filled and I had a time to wash my face today just plain water no soap and then I did my hair well I didn't brush my hair though I just did my hands and I was able to apply lipstick for you guys well just you know it, it it we look good if 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 we beautify ourselves especially that's i i am in front of the camera um and then i i, I had a time earlier but most of that time i i don't i don't do it I, I i go straight away by the way before i i record the podcast i already read about the scriptures of the day so that you know i can rehearse because that's just how I deal with the first hour of the day. I I read the scriptures and I reflect on it while I'm having my breakfast. I really should film it because when I am having my breakfast and I'm, when I'm reading the scripture, I have some thoughts that I want to share right away because if I don't, then those thoughts are are just being suppressed and... I won't be able to remember it anymore and I have also have some notes here that I um to guide me on my podcast today by the way guys this is an open podcast wherein I, I relay my message to you I share my thoughts to you and it's an open discussion you can comment at any time and share your knowledge as well because you know, every day I get humbled by my life's experiences and I've also need some of your feedbacks and some of your comments and strategies and, and how you deal with life because I'm not perfect as well. I'm just a human being. I depend on God and whatever I do. So it would be nice to to be able to hear from you and because sometimes I'm wrong and I, I, I make a mistake. So I'm just scared, you know, because um, I'm just scared that ang ako ni mga gipang tulo is dilima o, but yeah, this is an open discussion wherein your thoughts are welcome and I'm willing to share my thoughts as well. So without further ado, we need to share, we need to start this because I'm hearing my daughter from 9am to 10am, it, it it's that time when wherein she wakes up and i'm hearing some <laughs> cries now upstairs so let's do this so yes good morning guys and welcome to the podcast i'm located in canada and again it's in the morning so yesterday i, I wasn't able to do a podcast um my goal is uh, is that it should be a daily podcast but I don't want to disappoint you I will do my best to create a podcast daily however there are times nga it, it would be difficult for me to do it but uh, uh, I will never ever ever forget about reading the scriptures so that's how I deal with my morning I don't wash my face um, right away I just eat I just have breakfast because we weren't able to eat diba, for a long time for s- six to seven hours and then our bodies were digesting the food that we ate from yesterday 
and then so that means that I cannot function without the food, coffee, and water because wala ni suit sa atong lawas during the entire night. So that's why we have to nourish our bodies and to be able to fuel the brain as well. It's food for the brain, food for the body, and I I, I cannot. It, it will not give me the strength and the knowledge to be able to impart you my thoughts for the day, di ba? So we really need to eat. And not just eat, but eat healthy and eat clean. And yeah, be serious on our health. Because we glorify God through our bodies and the way we do it daily. So yesterday, I wasn't able to do a podcast because... It was Sunday. Today is Monday here. It's Sunday. Um, yesterday, uh, I, I always rem- remember to keep the holy day, to, to, to keep holy the Sabbath day. So since it's Sunday, um, I just spent time with my my family here. And we, we, we were able to talk, we were able to bond, we were able to play and just, you know, have have meal time and just spend time with each other bonding it's our bonding so i didn't film a podcast and we also went to church and hear the mass it was a struggle though because you know i have a three-year-old and it was her sleeping time during that time yesterday was at we went to church at 6 p.m and then it was a disaster we went we left early after the Eucharist because um, Hannah is feeling very sleepy already although it was already past the time of her nap time usually she naps at around 4.30 to 5 but it was at 6 p.m. so when we get home (laughs) she slept at around 7 to 11 p.m. so it was it was a long nap and she was so tired so i don't think we're, we were able to do we were able to attend the mass every sunday although that's a, a covenant i made to god that we need to go to church good guys because it's you know remember to keep holy the sabbath day but i i think the the lord will you know understand us if we just hear mass and the tv because Having a child is also a blessing and a curse, guys, diba? Right? Um, it, it's, it's hard. It's hard. It's hard to to have a kid and, um, yeah, and, and go to church because th- then they, they make noises and they, they, they're still little. They, they still need to learn, diba? Right? So, yeah. And then um yes that was on sunday yesterday and i'm a bit emotional today as well because you know my i have my raging hormones as a woman as a woman we have are are, are, like me i'm a very very moody person my my day depends on my mood (laughs) that's why i really need to exercise and be complete because you know I have my ebbs and flows too. So today, specifically, um, it started yesterday. My period started yesterday on a Sunday, and when I am my, I, I have my period. I'm, I'm I'm very emotional, and yeah, that's just a warning, <laughs> a warning for you because I might say things that I I don't intend to. That's why I have a guide here, just so I'm. I'm guided um, and also I, I got disappointed because you know we're, we're still trying to have a kid and having a period means no sex it will be a dull week wouldn't it yeah so no sex and that means that I'm not pregnant as well because we have been planning to to really get serious about this and that's the reason why i stopped working too because we want to conceive and having my period i got disappointed yesterday because i'm not pregnant i'm and i'm already 35 years old so my advice for 
singles and for the youngsters because you know you are the future of our generation that's why i am addressing my message to the singles to the youth you know to the young people because you all have the time and energy in the world and you have to use your time wisely so you know if you plan you plan ahead of time if you want kids uh, if you don't want kids that's okay that's perfectly okay if you if you plan to become single that's perfectly okay too because it's it's better to be single than be married with a jerk diba um if you if you decided to be to be married as well then you have you have to plan ahead of time and if you're planning to have kids then you have to to plan it as well the best time to have kids is when you are at the age of 22 up so you start early me i started having kids when i was at the age 30 to you know to prevent cervical cancer because i really wanted to enjoy my life i married at uh, at the age of 29 and then i got pregnant when i was 30 so and then now that i am 35 um we just have to do our priorities first and now we have the time in the world now that i am planning to get pregnant i got disappointed because i ha- i am having i i'm having my period today so we have our own plans but you know god has his own plan so we just have to depend on him so so that that's it um for for young women please take care of your body and if you want to get pregnant if you decided to get pregnant plan ahead of time um pregnancy is good from the age of 22 to up um 22 to 40 as long as you have your period then um you 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 can conceive so yeah so karun on first month after my miscarriage in december we started trying it right away now i have my period so i'm disappointed and i feel sad and yeah so we're just i'm just hoping for the best so please take care of your body i was taking care of my body but then 35 naman good go so i'm 35 years old so medyo lisod lisod na mas mas nindot man ang start ka diba og bata pa ka kaysa tigulang na but th- there's still hope guys i'm not losing hope so t- i'm 35 years old um i can conceive anytime from 35 to 40 and then as long as i have my period so, so we're just going to try and try harder so maybe it's not yet time pa kay bago pa mako nag miscarriage in December 17 last year in the year 2022 so yes so let's go ahead and read the scripture of the day um and it is taken from Sam I mean sorry it, it is taken from the book of Proverbs verse 16 Mm, and then in chapter 7 these are the highlights nga ako ang nakuha ang I was struck by the message when a man's ways please the Lord he maketh even his enemies to be at peace with him better is a little with righteousness than great that than great revenues without right a man's heart devised his way, but the Lord directed his steps. So, siya, no? A man's heart devised his way, but the Lord directed his steps. So, we're planning to get pregnant, but then I have my period. So, the, the, the Lord will direct our steps. And what else? A divine sentence is in the lips of the king. His mouth transgressed not in judgment. A just weight and balance are the Lord's. All the weights of the bag are His work. So, 
here another one that struck me today is uh, is in chapter 16 how much better is it to get wisdom than gold and to get understanding rather to be chosen than silver so my 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 ultimate goal in life is spirituality and i love i love to learn about wisdom i, I like to, to, to get wisdom than gold because that's my treasure but of course we have to work hard because we're here on earth and we have to um dapat ang life we have to enjoy our life on earth as much as possible another line that struck me is from chapter 20 he that handleth a matter wisely shall find good and whoso trusted in the lord happy is he mm. so that is the verse of the day oh actually the 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 bookmarks Actually, the main verse was from Proverbs 16, chapter 7. When a man's ways please the Lord, he make it even his enemies to be at peace with him. That's my bookmark. I'm so sorry, guys. Cannot find it na. Diri na lang sa kong phone. So, yes. Yeah, so, it's the main verse of the day was taken from Proverbs 16, Chapter 3. Oh, Proverbs. Na nakanyon sa naman ko, guys. Ay, sorry, guys. My hormones. It's my hormones. I can hear my my child crying na po. So, natarantar na ko. <laughs> um, verse of the day is from Proverbs 16. 3. Chapter or verse 3. Commit thy works unto the Lord, and thy thoughts shall be established. So that that's the main um, chap uh, verse of the day. Oh my God! It's a blessing of an a corresponding ay bata manggod. But when you see them sleeping, makaingon po nga. What have I done, Lord, for me to deserve this kind of blessing? He, she's an amazing child. It's just that when mga ingani, dili na takadali, dali og film, diba? That's the reason why I do this daily, but I have to show you guys nga gigibuhat yun siya na ako kayo. If it's not documented, if it's not taken on video, it's not done. Kaya lahat naman ka yung generation ko na to, diba karon. But I do this daily, good. It's just that as a mother, maglisod na ko. But I, I always share the daily verse of the day on my socials, especially on my Facebook page. So, mm, uh, I, I just want you to know that I am very grateful uh, that sa mga feedbacks that I receive online, I'm seeing some positivity and willing to lend a hand, willing to help each other. I am so um, impressed, but by but, but but what what I see online now, that people are suddenly emerging from their sleep, and they woke up from their sleep. So it, it, yeah, it would be nice to continue that, and let's help and build each other, so that we can create. Um, an amazing life here on earth, diba? So, yeah, my take for today is if, if you're, if you're happy, you, you don't, you don't have to hide. The Lord said, um, do not fear because I am the Lord. And, um, I have, I have seen some messages online to to walk with fear with the lord it it doesn't mean that you 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 don't have to be scared in your daily day to day life i always fear god i always you know whatever i decide on my actions i always rely on god and because i fear him 
I fear him he, because he is my master. He is my boss. So I fear my my boss all the time. And um, yeah, we, we, we need to, to walk with fear with the Lord. Um, we need to imitate the fire signs because the Aries, you know, jumps into action without without overseeing the scene. You know, Leo is very brave. They they protect their cubs, the lions. They they protect their cubs, and Sagittarius is very is uh, is very courageous. Sagittarius has courage, so we have to imitate the fire sign because they are fearless. And in the Bible, the Lord says we have to do not fear because I am the Lord your God. I am with you. And then I'm seeing some online to 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 walk in fear to walk in fear don't be scared so and of course if if you're happy we, we don't have to hide if we're happy i'm seeing some people nga wala na dugay nang wala nagpakita online but I, i'm seeing their presence today and yeah let's let's help build each other I found a strategy on, on how we can we can help each other because if a person is not happy then we're not gonna be happy as well diba so what what I learned is that I, I dig deeper and I dig deeper and I did my research is that we have to help them we have to share a secret um, we, we do not walk with fear every day we have to get out because diba yung na ginoo nga we have to share our talent, our time, and our treasure. Now, now, if you bury your talents, it will not multiply. But if you show off, if you showcase your talent to the world and you, you glorify God through your talents and your abilities in life, then, the, then God is glorified as well. But you also have to remember that it, it's everything is from the lord you have to glorify the lord you have to proclaim the lord that because of god you have this talent you have this ability you have this knowledge because everything comes from god diba right? so um yeah stop sleeping stop hiding um i i would be doing a video about this um i will i, I refer to this as the, the theory of Maslow's hierarchy of needs where in the last step is the self-actualization in comparison to Eric Erickson's theory of development stages so sa ato adam, uh, when we become adult it's it's uh, tam, it's either mustagnata or natay generativity generativity means we are generous with the wisdom when when we share our knowledge and our skills to the world so it's either mustagnate ka or mo generate ka wisdom so i will be tackling that in the other video but in nursing that's our foundation nga i relate it to my experience in life and i relate it to spirituality as well so mo na siya dili ta kinahanglan mo about nga 60 years old ta before we can help other people and before we share um in in my secret is that i've been uh watching motivational videos be it in be it with Jim Rohn Jim Rohn is a famous motivational speaker Jim Rohn Brian Tracy to Tony Robbins Joel Austin and then most of my influence um, my influence came from Brother Bo Sanchez. He is a preacher at the feast, our, our, our weekly gathering. He's the founder. And I've always um, watched his videos daily from 2015. It's either 2000. Ako gasod. It's either 2013, ah, 14, 15, 16, ah, 13, 14. 2014 15 because i met my husband in 2015 two years before that na ano na ko nag nag feast na ko and so from 2015 up to 2023 i always read the uh, i always read na pa may mga scriptures at tong 
na mag, magpadala man siya email every single day. We have God Whispers na wala na ako nag-subscribe kay naputol na ako subscription because I, I developed my own uh, because of that I was subscribed and I was able to develop my own routine as well. So he helped me with that. Um so magtanaw gyud ko siya mga video libre libre na siya na na mga video sa YouTube. So if you search Bo, San- Bo Sanchez inspirational talk at the feast there are millions of videos over there. So what I did was sa una ato single pa ko I would watch the whole day daghan kay episode sa kung gitan uh, from even up to now but karon nga na nakoy anak it's not every single day na kay na, na, it, uh, it reached a point where in um i have uh, uh, most topics diba mag repeat na man and then magbalik-balik and it reached to the point nga murag halos nakit ana nako tanan ang mga videos and then when I feel disconnected na po, I watch again and again and again and over and over again. So that's just my secret. I watch the videos day and night, day and night when I was single. When I was married, karon nga, na anak ko anak, medyo dili na siya every single day. Kaya murang na, na internalize na nako ang mga teachings. So yeah. So, moto siya sa sa kakuan po Maslow's hierarchy of needs na po tayo gitawag nga self-actualize na ka if nakuha na niya mo itong mga basic needs is that housing, water, air, food, sex. No, it doesn't mean, ka, ka siya, I, I need to tackle each topic pa ka ng one by one but it's it's it, the 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 main essence is that the first ladder is on air water food sex you have to breathe the right the fresh air air nga not polluted to be for you to be able to be healthy and so that your body could you know absorb it divide it it's not just air nga polluted so uh, aside from that um Main example po is the food. Food, it's not just eating merely food, but eating food that could benefit our body, like eating more fruits and vegetables and less red meat and drinking lots of fluid. And, you know, it's just uh, life is just a balance. And we, we also need to exercise. So after my talk, um, I will go and... Um, we will have our routine with my child and then I will exercise for 20 minutes a day because yesterday na exercise got around 11 p.m. na was because I feel so weak so I, I needed to be strong physically that's the reason why my exercise na good goes every single day kay lahi na good ng my exercise ka every day you know just you know uh, an achievable amount of time for me as a mother is just 20 minutes a day now, um, aside from that, in Canada, gi emphasize ko nila nga sa basic needs na ang sex. Of course, we all are, are we, uh, uh, was, sa akong na learn sa nursing, kita tanan sexual gita, even the infant at zero months. But you also need to explain to your child nga, dili pa siya pwede mag sex, kay lali makag 3 years old pa ni. <laughs> So when the right time comes, pwede na. But for us married people, we are enjoying the benefits of marriage now, di ba? So I can talk about sex. Um, yeah, this is for married people, single people. Relax lang sa mo, di pa mo? We, we don't advise you to have you know, sex because sex is in the context of marriage. The Ten Commandments is a set up that is, is a set up for a happy life, for happiness. If you follow it, then there's there's pure joy and happiness. So sa sex po, dili po tabasta mo to kong first video ng how to find your one true love. Sa sex po, dili po tabasta basta mo hataglag sex. We have to give sex to the people or to the person that we enjoy having sex with. We we connect ourselves mentally, physically, intellectually, socially. Di apare si socially. 
nga ang socially mo stem up na siya sa culturally o napatoy sa kali <laughs> and then the sexually emotionally na daghan kay na interconnected ka ayo guys you have to be completely complete to to be able to thrive on earth and of course our ultimate goal is to go to heaven so we have to be completely complete and that's the reason why please if you are happy don't hide just you know share your secrets in life we help other people we go back to Maslow's hierarchy of human needs in where we need to to meet the basic needs food and sex the best sex should be done with the right person and then at a security and security love and belongingness and then the highest ladder is the self-actualization in where wala na makapugong na to we have our divine connection to God. Wala makapugong na to nga. We are fearless. We are, basta completely complete. Makaabot na nga stage nga. Makatabang ta sa tao. And, and we have to learn that. There is a strategy in which we, we can learn that and we can help people at an early age. That Now that I'm 35 years old, um, I use my experience as a nurse the theory in nursing that I learned from school, my experiences in life, my experiences of my mentors, the community that I serve, the experiences of other people, and you know, just by observing the world, the universe. So, dako kayo ang scope, and dako kayo ang responsibility. That's why we, we need to start now. Um, after na ko ma-edit ako mga videos, no, magama ko uh, video about the theory of Maslow's hierarchy of human needs in and Eric Erikson's theory of um, the developmental stages. Kay grabe siya ka importante guys. Importante kay as a nurse gi pa learn gyud mi ana sa school kay to avoid judgment sa tao because most of the people nga manha sa hospital they need help and they're sick. So uh, in nursing gitudluan mi ana to be able to heal ourselves po nga we we go through um, certain challenges in life and we must not judge people we we help them heal and we help them get better if they sick if they are sick um so monash and now dili we 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 need to be fearless we need to be brave we need to be courageous and there is a way para dili ta kontrahan sa mga tao. Ano nga? Why is she so happy? Because if if other people are not happy, then we're not going to be happy as well. But be kind, be kind, and uh, understand them. And yeah, we need to share our knowledge and skills on on how to be it. Because the two theories would would help you. Ingon tiba ingon si Jim Rohn nga. If you're feeling down, you don't need motivation. But what you need is education to turn you around. So it's we we need um intellectual intellectual stuff and we need all of the aspects in life, ha. Huh? It should be interconnected. Cephalocaudal, cephalo is the head, caudal, body and the feet. So cephalocaudal is from head to feet head to foot so we need to use our head every organ our eyes nose from here heart lungs stomach you know digestive system legs feet it's our circulation everything must function for for us to be able to be a, a self, self-actualized person next to wrap up no to wrap up what i learned from my my mentor brother bo sanchez is that the world is a buffet of blessings we just need to open our eyes to open our ears to open our minds if you're married you need to open your legs and i'm just kidding no okay i I want this to be an an enjoyable experience i I don't want to bore you so the but self-actualized the interconnected you turn on that senses but yeah the world is a buffet of blessings and dili ka mahadlok ay maghide ko kay makaawat pa lang na ubang tao and I, I don't want other people to be successful because I work hard I work or work hard for my success pero dili din nga no sa theory ni Maslow 
og ni Theorine Erickson, we have to kuan help other people po. but be, be, of course before you help other people you have to help yourself you have to be the best version of yourself for you to be able to say nga ay pwede na ako sila i-help diba kaya sa, sa sa talk ni brother Bo we are we, we have uh, different seasons in life uh, we have summer spring winter and fall so sa winter season mo na siya nga matiguwang na ta 60 years old and up and or 80 years old and up, nga naan ata sa kuha niya, either gahawat na lang tagmamatay ta, or on siya itong purpose sa kinabuhi, so ka nang gahawat na lang sila nga, mamatay sila, they, they, they share their wisdom to people, because I work in a long-term care, mostly the people there are from, um, 80 years old and up, na ay 60, 67, but mostly is 80 years old and up, they're, they're just in the bed, waiting for 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 the lord's call and then they share their wisdom so we don't have to reach that age para ma realize na to na if we're you know complete now and we strive to be complete we can attain that and we can help other people because sa sa ka Rick Warren's book but we, we are here for a purpose life we we're here on earth for a purpose Uh, which is to help people to glorify God by helping other people yes yeah, so the, the world is a buffet of blessing you just need to open up your senses dili ka nga nga makuan mahadlok mahadlok kay na mga tao di ba nga mangguba but the world is a buffet of blessings it doesn't mean yan ingon ko ni mo nga um you have to how to find your one true love dili sa ingon nga magunay na ang mama og ang son ang father og ang daughter ang in-laws no because the world is a buffet of blessing you you know you you get your cir- circle bigger you go out to the world and kay sa earth pila mata ka billion nga tao there are a lot of people on earth dili ka magwad og pag-asa murag buffet ba buffet is unlimited eating there's unlimited food pareha ra na sa life life is a buffet of blessings you have to learn how to be a blessing magnet nga makaingon ka nga uy i'm a blessing magnet uy i i develop my own podcast it's a blessing i had a miscarriage But then I will use my pain for gain. Oh, that's a blessing. Blessings and blessings and blessings. Kaning akong iPhone, para na ko, miracles. It's a blessing because I was, you know, hoping for this. This microphone, the MacBook that I'm using, it's all the it's all miracles from life. Now, if you follow God, His promise is that He will give you all the desires of your heart. Sometimes, ipospon niya ang uban, but in the right time, He will give you your heart's desire. Diba? Maghuwat lang ta in His own time. And, kanang napamagoy mga giparealize na to. That's the reason why madelay ang uban. But the world is a buffet of blessing. Dili ta mahadlok nga nag-teach ta. And then, um, dili ta mahadlok nga mag-teach ta. And then, mas maayo pa ang atong gitichan. mas if if you're a teacher you get happy if your students are are more skillful and are more knowledgeable than you dili ta ma, mahadlok malupigan because you you should be happy if your students are better than you meaning the teacher is amazing the teacher is a good teacher the teacher is an excellent teacher if the students follow and the students glow the, the students develop or ma makuha niya ang talent so i'm so sorry gadali na gud ko kay 10 am na and this time mata na gyud na ako anak so i need to prepare milk pa ilisan siya you know cuddle cuddle mommy and baby and like that and 40 minutes na data so yes guys the world is a buffet of blessings you just have to open your senses develop a different kind of mindset nga ang ang earth grabe gud kadaghan ang resources nato diri dili ta maguwang kay life is a buffet of blessings I- imagine lang ang pagkaon nga daghan kay yung pagkaon an unlimited you're paying for like 2000 pesos and it's unlimited ingana kadaghan 
unlimited. We just don't realize it. But, mo na nga, we, we continue on our learning and you strive for more knowledge. Be hungry for the word of God. And that's it for the day. I hope you are blessed by this talk and I love you all so much. By the way, ang goal you know, role you know, ko sa kinabuhi nga ako na unlock is that I want to be a mother. I like mothering. I like nurturing people. When you open my heart, you see Yeah, when you open my heart, you see love. I want everybody to succeed. That's the role of of mothers, de ba? I'm and a bit I'm I'm a bit soft, but I'm also tough. When you know my 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 cup is empty, my daughter and my husband could could des- testify to that on how I am when my cup is empty because I become incredible hook. I'm just so soft at the video guys but I have I have I, I give as much as I would like to to give soft love I give tough love as well and I'm very tough but yeah Mona I, I am a mother and I want you I, I want to see all of my children succeed so to na nag na ang na siya see you guys I love you you have a great day bye